I went back to read Hamas, some of Hamas's founding documents and the, the modifications to them in two, I think it's in 2017, the modification. And the modifications are couched in this kind of language. So what the student statements basically are, are paraphrases of Hamas's, what, it's not the founding documents, but the revision of Hamas's founding document or charter. So they talk about Israel, but it, now it's often, it's the Zionist project as a racist colonial project and so on. And you find that in the, in the student um, statements. So th there's a way in which you can read the, the statement and the Harvard one is the, I think the one that's making the rounds, the, the one people have heard about of various student organizations at Harvard, but there's more than that. And there's been more demonstrations and demonstrations in places like Detroit and so on. Um, the, the that statements you can think of as it's they're almost spokesmen for Hamas, echoing their talking points. And part of to get at the motivation here, it is a nihilistic motivation. It is a love of destruction for destruction. And they're students, so it's possible there's some element of that in their soul and something better that's been twisted and twisted partly by what they've been taught in the classroom, but it's not only that. And part of the evidence for that is if you actually cared about individual Palestinians and individual lives and prosperity, you would recognize that the one nation in the Middle East that stands above every other nation is Israel. And it would be, how can the other places be more like Israel? Not how can we wipe Israel off the map? How do we gain that prosperity, that freedom, um, uh, that ability to live? And how do we model that? How do we learn from that? And the fact that Hamas is a dictatorship, and that is what the students, oh, well, we don't have a problem with that. And we don't have a problem if what they've opposed in Gaza is a religious dictatorship in which everyone in Gaza is terrified of them um, and of, 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 of executions. And, and so it's not right to think of the Hamas just terrorizes Jews. They have a special animus against Jews, but they terrorize their own population. And the fact that the students, that that is, yeah, we're okay with that. And to regard that as your pro-Palestinian, in the sense of pro anyone in these places that actually wants a better life, wants to live in peace, and wants to emulate all the good things about Israel, you've sold them out and betrayed them. And that they masquerade around, like that they care about justice, freedom, and people's actual lives. It, it, I mean, it really is a moral travesty and they should be called out by the universities and by other campus groups on camp, other student bodies that like, we find this morally abhorrent. 